internal electric actuators designed for fail safe electric applications. This one here is set up with a fire safe ball valve as a manual override. The motor itself has a clutch brake assembly on the top. It's designed to power open a set of springs which are mounted either side here. When the actual unit is open or closed depending on which way the ball valve is set up, the brake here locks the unit off and it waits until such time when the power is removed the springs close the unit back down again. So this is used for fail safe applications say for instance petrochemical or any other area which is remote and you require electric actuation. The units are available in multi voltages from 240 down to 12 volt DC and they come in various sizes. This one here is the smallest of them and they go up to larger sizes for operating butterfly or ball valves. They're an IP67 rated unit and the legend plate here gives it various specifications. Uh, has epoxy fusion, fusion bonded coating on the outside and we can interface it with various valves. I'll just operate this unit, power it up It's reached the end of its travel, so the valve itself is opened and the unit is now locked off with the electromagnetic brake system on the top and it will stay in that position until such time as the power is removed. I'll remove the power and the springs themselves now have pushed the unit back and closed it back down again. The wiring is relatively straightforward, it comes with its own manual and of course this is just set up with the wiring. Normally it comes through the cable gland and here we have the, the unit which goes on, this is the cap that goes on, has a visual indicator on the top and with an IP67 rated unit. This unit is a 24DC unit. Uh, the wiring is pretty straightforward. We've got positive going into number one on the terminal block and negative going into three of the terminal block. Uh, as, as a spring return unit, it doesn't require power to, to close it, so it just requires a switch to power it on and to operate the unit.